The Democratic presidential debate took place in Atlanta, Georgia last week, so obviously we had to send our nine-year-old presidential expert, Macy Hensley, to be our correspondent. Take a look. Hi, Ellen, it's me, Macy, and I'm here in Atlanta, Georgia, home of the next Democratic debate and the Jimmy Carter Library. I can't wait. Hi. Hi, Macy, how are you? I'm good. I'm Dr. Meredith Evans, welcome. Still handshaking? <laughs> President Carter grew up right? on a peanut farm. On a peanut farm. And when he was a little boy, he um, supposedly shot his sister with a BB gun and then she threw a wrench at him. So I want to become president and I'm going to go to the Democratic debate. So you think you can help me practice debating? Yeah, sure. Let's All do right. that. All right. So here you go. This is nice. for you. And then here's mine. And then I have here. So our first debate topic is country music is the best type of music. I believe that country music is the best type of music because, I mean, it's something that you can dance to, and it's it's just a, okay. Um, just go ahead and just try this again. Country music's the second best kind of music because sometimes the songs are way too sad. Oh, all right. Now, I do agree with you. I mean, all country songs are basically about either drinking, love, or heartbreak. Somebody. So, Macy, here's a gift. This is one of President Carter's early books, and it's signed. Wow. Just for you. Is that your first book signed by a president? I have one for Bush. <laughs> it can be our second one. <laughs> So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, I've too. heard so much about you. Looks pretty cool. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Do you want to try standing up at one of those podiums? Sure. Want to see how it feels? Macy Hensley, come on out to the stage. Woo! Here we go, Macy. As President of the United States, what would your platform be? Well, definitely, uh, my mom's a teacher. Get teachers' pay raised. We need to help our farmers and, of course, make America kinder. Macy Hensley, everyone. Great job. Hi, I'm Kamala Harris. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So what do you do to prepare for the debate? I eat lots of cookies. Well, here, would you like one? Oh, yes, actually. These are my favorite chocolate chip. Thank you. Good. I know a bunch of president facts. Uh -huh. And James Madison was the shortest president. Oh. So if you become president, you might be the shortest president. And how tall was he? And did he wear heels? Yeah. So is it true that you have four names? Uh, that is true, yeah. Now, do you know the only other president to have four names? Ooh. No, no, wait. George Herbert Walker Bush, yes. right? Yes. Yes. All right. So if you win, you'd be the youngest president. So do you have any advice for me? Well, you seem like you're way ahead of me. Definitely where I was at your age. So maybe I should be asking you for advice. You got anything I should think about? Just follow your dreams. How about that? That's good advice. All right. Thank you very much. Very nice meeting you. Take care. Excuse me. So who came up with your Yang Gang? It was the Yang Gang itself. And then it just caught on. I, I just want to give him a hug if I can. Yeah. Oh, he's being kind to me. Oh. <laughs> what would be the first thing you guys would do if you moved well, into the White House? Well, if I'm president, one of the things I'm going to do is invite him over for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> you're not married, are you? I am not married. All right, so do you think that you're going to be a bachelor like James Buchanan? Or are you going to get married in the White I House like Grover Cleveland? that's a question to ask my, my girlfriend. Oh, my gosh, we're going to have for Rosario. Yeah, Yes, yeah, sure. The star power in this interview just went up. <laughs> so do you think he'll end up being a bachelor like James Buchanan, or will he get married in the White House like Grover Cleveland? I think the question really needs to come from him. Oh, I see, I see. Oh. Can you I'm help? a little old-fashioned on that can, one. Can you help me negotiate something here? <laughs> I feel like we're going to make major world news right now. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Ellen, for sending me here. I had so much fun here in Atlanta doing the Democratic debate. Bye. Bye. Thank you for You're sending me. Macy here, she's awesome. Thanks, Macy. Thanks, Kristen Welker and NSNBC. We'll be right back.